for tuning in this Halloween evening. Now, bro, the big story of the day is that Vista Power Station will be undergoing a scheduled maintenance tomorrow evening at 8 p.m. that may disrupt power for the entire country. But, bro, only for five minutes. Five minutes, sure. But just for safety, lah, bro. I suggest no one thinks. What the heck lah? You scared me! Sorry, sorry. I didn't mean it. Maybe if you take a look of your work once in a while, you will notice more new things. I didn't know you are still around. I thought I was alone. Anyways, I'm going off already. Ah. You don't stay too late, okay? Yes, Mom. Left something behind. Oi. Sharon, it's not funny, okay? <laughs> Ma'am, we're running some tests now on the material. Ma'am. Over there. So, what do we have here? It is the same as before. Hmm. Ma'am. Hey, Sally. Why am I not surprised to see you here? Well, Staying at home won't bring her back to life. You know, I like work. Keeps my mind off things. After all these years, you should know me. I don't need you now. You should get home. Let's just go back to work, shall we? I'm fine. Okay. So, what do we have here? Francine Pua, a designer here. Same memo? I'm afraid so, yeah, same memo. Most likely, rape. A lot of trauma. Everything down below her waist is covered with oil. Just like the rest of other victims. Strangled to death. CCTV? When her office power went down, CCTV also died. They must have some sort of a backup, right? Something must have been recorded. No. We found nothing. 
Demikianlah. The public is asking questions, and the chief is breathing down my neck. But there isn't a lot to work on, right? Forensics came back with no DNA evidence at all. Nothing. Zero. And you know this is not normal, right? Well, it just means the killer is a very careful man. Or maybe this is the work... No. Don't. Saleh, you really have to stop with this nonsensical theory of yours. It's not nonsensical, Indra. And what do you want me to tell the chief? That this was done by some boogeyman from some old Malay folklore? It's not a Malay folklore. Indra, you know what I told you? There were actually sightings and cases back in the 50s to the early 70s. About this? Yeah, yeah. Which was probably made up by some concerned mothers not wanting their daughters to go out late at night, Saleh. Maybe. Yeah, you got a point there. But maybe, just maybe. Indra, this is not just an old grandmother's tale. I know you hate me saying this. But what about the oil on the glass doors? We the do not the... know whether it's oil. It is oil, Indra. Just admit it. It's clearly the work of... No. No. Don't you even say it. Sir, ma'am, the forensic came back with the preliminary results of the imprints. And what is it? Ray. Let's go. Anything I'll update you. Indra, don't forget the birthday cake. Yes, sir. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Ray. Happy birthday to you. Would you like to blow the candles out? Nope. New article? What is it about? I'm sorry I'm late. But it's still early. We can go out and have supper. It's fine. Ray, I remember what we spoke at Dr. Chan's. I know I have to change. But it's just that this current case that I'm working on is really important. I'm trying my best. I went to see Daddy today. You said you saw him three days back. Yet, I saw no flowers. I was supposed to see him. I even got him the flowers, but there was another case which needed my attention and I... So you lied to me about it? I'm really trying. I know I need to cut down on my work. And I need you to know that I will do it. And you are more important to me than any of these cases. Yes. That's what you promised my dad before he died. You're pretty good keeping up with it. Ray, I'm really trying here. 
you can go on and on about what an unqualified mom I am to you. But instead, we can make this day a great one. Let's go out, have supper, have a good time. Um, I can call up the taco place that you used to love. Remember? The one that daddy used to bring you to? I... Hello. Indra, that guy found something. You may want to see this. I'm coming. I'll come back as soon as possible. Then maybe we can go Whatever. out. Whatever. Happy birthday, Ray. So, what do we have? A month ago, there was a series of staff in the office. So the boss installed a hidden camera unknown to everyone else. And? It caught everything? Every single thing. Let's do that. Wait. The camera needed a few seconds to on to the nightmare. Keith, anything? Stop! Sir, this is your last warning! I said stop! It's not me. Ma'am, there's a situation in the car park. Knees to the ground! You hear me? Knees to the ground now! <laughs> Hands over your head! Keith! The scheduled maintenance at Vista Power Station went awry at approximately 8.05 p.m. tonight that quickly caused a massive island-wide blackout. Panic and chaos erupted throughout the country as Vista Power Station released a statement promising the return of power within the next hour. Singaporeans are recommended to stay home or indoors as Hey. Has it been a week already? Yep. A week, yes. And ideal? 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 Yeah. It's okay. We are coping. I think he's feeling a little awkward now because, I mean, after taking care of Mila for months and months, and then suddenly she's not there. But I think he'll need some time. He'll get better, I'm sure. Anyway, uh, any updates on the blackout? Uh, well, massive traffic jams everywhere. The chief recommends that we stay here and bring him back when the power returns. Do you think he's the killer? Him? I don't know. I mean, if he really is the killer, then why suddenly he wants to confess after five murders? It doesn't make sense. Right? Sir, ma'am, Muxin Motalik. 45 years old, his only next of kin is his daughter, Maya. 
wife is deceased and he's in between jobs because he needs to take care of his sick daughter. Any criminal records? No, ma'am. No criminal records, no mental health records. Even his fingerprints did not match any of the previous crime scenes. Is this actually lead or are we just wasting our time? It's one way to find out. Muxin Mutalib. First and foremost. He's coming, he's coming, he's coming. What? The black cow. It's impossible to stop him now. Please, you help me out. You said you killed Francine Pua and four others before her. Is that true? Yes, yes, yes. No, I did, I did, I did. Do you know them? No, I don't know them. I just saw them. And if he likes what he sees, he will make me take them. <laughs> please, call me up now somewhere safe, please. Somewhere safe, please. So that you cannot escape, please. I'm saying, you know, calm down. Please. I'm Lock me up now. I say that. Lock me up. <laughs> 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 Seven women. That was the deal. What? Seven women. Seven days. I told him it's too much. I can't. <laughs> but now he's only five. He wants more. He wants more. I'm sorry. I'm not a monster. I'm not a monster! I'm not a monster! I have a little girl! <laughs> I can control myself. It's no one controlling me. Please lock me up now, please! Please! Why, Bate? Because he's an orang minyak. Huh? He is an orang minyak. I still have the kain batik from Mila's funeral. Yet. Yes, sir. Uh, take for me. Take the kain batik. Salim. Stop. Now. Come. It's inside the car's dashboard, the kain batik. Okay? They keep after that lock this door. It's not safe. Okay? Yes, sir. Hey, why are you pushing this nonsensical orang minyak theory of yours? I didn't push anything. He confessed. You heard? No. He alluded to it because you just jumped in with your own conclusion. Because it is the only conclusion. You know, this thing that possesses him, it doesn't have a shape. It needs a host. So this Moksin guy is the only one he has right now before he moves on to another. Oh, please. Please stop. And besides that, what has Bate got to do with any of this? According to the legend, this thing will make him weak. Kills all his powers. Hose. A zest. So, so you mean what? This thing just won't die, is it? Indra. How do you kill evil? Explain to me. How? Salih, I seriously cannot believe that you're buying all of this. Just because you don't believe in this thing, that doesn't mean it doesn't exist. You know what? We have worked together long enough to know that demons and evil don't kill people. People kill people. You know, I'm just so surprised that of all people, you, the logical thinking cop, would actually buy this. This is just so dumb and illogical. What do you want me to put in the report? There's a ghost? Seriously? I could have arrested you for this. What for? Exposing the truth? The public deserves to know what happened to those girls. Hey, look. 
Don't start with this whole song and dance and what the public deserves to know, okay? This is about getting back at me and I know that. <laughs> you really think this was about me getting back at you? How self-indulgent can you be? Look, Ray, the public will know everything when the time is right. But you trespassing like this? For your stupid online news site? Really you just I don't care. You're not concerned about this. You know what? I care about a lot of things. But right now, I'm more concerned about you breaking the law. Now, where you... have you cared? You just pretended to care when Dad was alive. You know what? He's dead. And you don't have to pretend anymore. You know what? You're right. I don't care. I don't care about you. But I really wanted to, Ray. Everyone knows. Everyone knows that I tried my best to make you like me. Just so that the three of us could have been a family. I can never replace your mother. I know that. So I didn't even attempt to do so. But what did I get in return? You can grieve over losing your father all you want. But I too lost my husband. You're not the only one in pain, you know. I wish, I just bloody wish that I could share my pain with you, but did you ever give me a chance? Jade. Yes, ma'am. Keep her here. Yes, ma'am. Besok, okay? Besok, besok kita pergi ke rumah. Hmm. Saya tahu. Ayah pun rindu mak juga. Rindu sangat. Tapi nak buat macam mana? Kalau kau, kau duduk rumah saja. Mereka kata sekejap lagi baru dalam balik. Nah. Penyang keluar tau. Tak selamat. Ah, duduk rumah saja. Okey. Take care. Bye. Macam mana dia meninggal, Cik? Ha? Siapa yang meninggal? Isteri Cik, macam mana dia meninggal? Cancer stage 4. Anak saya pun sakit, Cik. Leukemia. Stage 4. Tapi dia dah baik, Cik. Tak. Bohong. Ada orang yang kena stage 4 cancer kritikal boleh sembuh. Boleh baik, tak boleh. Mustahil. Dia dah baik, Cik. So, pasal, pasal anak kau kau buat semua ini? Satu, dua, tiga, empat, lima, enam, tujuh. 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 Keith. Sir. Indra, boy. Stay with me. You and the boys, stay with me. Sir. Huh?
Hey. You okay now? Mm. You sure? Yeah, I'm good. So, what's going on in there? He's just waiting. I got our boys in there to stay with him. And the power? Power? Can you say another hour? They said an hour. An, an hour, hour ago. ago. Da, it's okay to cry, you know. You know that? I didn't see you cry at the funeral. Oh, because I'm too much to cry in public, that's why. I don't know whether this helps, but I did too also so rebellious just like me when he was at age. I didn't. Yeah. That's it's strange. You know, we were not that close to each other until Mila fell ill. Then only we spend more time together, talk. And when Mila passed, well, sorry, 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 sorry. you know, when he removed the kain batik of Mila at the funeral and put it in my car's glove compartment, he insisted that the last thing Mila wore is with me always. All the time. It's really sweet, huh? And you're really lucky. I'm lucky. Eh, don't say like that. Ah, I know I am, but in that, just give her some time. You're all she has left. You need one another. I have men down and they skip suspect. I need backup now. Now! Indra, go get me. Go, Indra. No, I'm not gonna leave you here. Indra, he said he needs two more. Just go. You'll be safe, okay? I'll be fine. in danger. Well, at least we are safe here now, right? Anyway, your mom really cares about you. Whether you like it or not, she's one of the best officers in the country. 
Indra Rao is the reason why I chose to be a CID officer. First of all, she's not my mother. Secondly, she's just such a workaholic. She wasn't even near my father's deadbeat. Look, I can't comment on that. But what I can say is, every time you complain she's not at home, she's out there keeping people safe. And every time you complain she's not around for you, a person is possibly being saved. So, who's the selfish one now? But the cloth is in the car's dashboard. Hmm. Grab your own. Ray, go. Where's Ray? Ma'am, Ray is safe. Come. Okay, you'll be fine. I'm here, you just hang in there. Okay? Jay? Musin, lawan Musin. 
Ray, wake up! It's me, wake up! Thank God. You're safe now, okay? I'm here. Everything will be okay. Wake up! Why Bate? Because he's in Oramia. What has Bate got to do with any of this? This thing will make him weak. Kills all his powers. Stop it on him. Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Ah! 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 Abah minta maaf, sayang. Abah minta maaf. Mr. Idil, I'm sorry to tell you that your father has suffered a very critical injury to his brain due to the impact that he encountered. My advice is to be by his side during this difficult period. Brace yourself. 
as he might not survive. <laughs> I can save his life. What did you say? Your father. I can save him. Who are you?